You know, I know that so many of the intangibles were, you know, the reasons I ended up becoming an Olympian. I was coachable. I, I was willing to put in the extra work, um, you know, being a good teammate, but really like the leadership of Coach Candrea just absolutely was a huge factor in the success that I had. I am a very competitive person and I do not like to lose, but that game was hands down the most fun softball game I have ever played in. I do remember that 11th inning and Kat Dotson got on base and Lauren Gibson got on base. And I remember thinking, walking up to the plate, this is my opportunity to try to score some runs here. Sure enough, I watched the first pitch go by, strike one. And in my head, I'm thinking, well, there goes my pitch. I just blew it. And <laughs> I stepped out of the box, tried to flush it in my mind. And don't tell Karen I said this, but I was like, I am swinging at this pitch and I am swinging as hard as I possibly can. <laughs> Sure enough, it hits my bat, and that ball ended up going out of the park. I had no idea. I thought it was just going to be a line drive in the gap, so I took off sprinting. And uh, our assistant coach at the time, Marty McDaniel, was over at first base. He's like, slow down. It went out. It went out. So at that point, lost our minds. We were so excited. And then, of course, everybody knows what happened with the Sooners ended up coming back. I love coaching players that have lofty goals and expectations for themselves. So I think the, the biggest things that I look for is players that do it the right way. They don't take shortcuts, they don't make excuses. I want them to be self-sufficient. I want them to be the best, be their absolute best. Number one is culture. You know, uh, the glamorous part of the game, uh, Sandy, as you know, is winning championships and you know having certain types of players that go on to achieve a certain success. So that creates the notoriety, right? And I understand that, but the, the active word inside the firecrackers is culture. Create an environment that people want to be part of, create an environment that treats people right, and our number one core principle is the golden rule. Two different people, very similar in their impact to the game, um, but the fact that they were able to come together and have that coach-player relationship and also go down in history is something that I'm really proud about what UCLA softball is all about. And watching them play on the Olympic stage was as a coach, it's those are those moments that makes all of the grind and work and good times, bad times, it makes it all worth it. That they, that they get the opportunity to be able to represent something that's so special.